To swallow a camel. Is it like having a lump in your throat? No, because then it would be attempting to swallow the camel. You swallowed the camel. If you are familiar with our podcast, Bad People on BBC Sounds, you will know that Julia, the scientist, speaks science and I, the comedian, speak Danish. I'm now going to test Julia on her Danish knowledge. We're going to go through some Danish idioms. Mm -hmm. I'm going to let you know one and then you can tell me what it means. There is no cow on the ice. It's not cold yet. It's not, we're not ready. We're not ready for it. So say it's like so. Say you've like murdered your entire family, and you buried them like under the floorboards, like really deep, so like even cadaver dogs can't get to them. And then someone is like, "Hey, are you gonna be on trial for murder?" You'd say, "It's no cow on the ice." Don't worry about it. There is no problem. There's no problem. Because if the cow was on the ice, it would be a problem. What if it's? Perfectly frozen. This is Denmark, like not Canada. <laughs> Our ice is thinner, so the cow would die. Then that goat is shaved. We've now shaved the goat. It looks ridiculous. You look ridiculous. The situation is ridiculous. So say it's like you've murdered your entire family. <laughs> Again, there's a lot of murder in Denmark. And you and you, Danish idioms. You meant to do it. And afterwards, you might be like, I shaved the goat. I finally did it. Yeah. Sort of like that's done. There are owls in the bog. In the bog? Uh, there's something lurking in the dark? So say you've okay. murdered your entire family. And then someone asks you, have you murdered your entire family? And you're like, no. But you're like, no. Then someone might say, hmm, I think there are owls in the bog. Oh, it's suspicious. Oh, it's suspicious. Those owls in the bog. Yeah, that's why would they be there? I feel like an egg yolk. I feel sunny, happy, so runny, thick, disgusting, delicious, like I need some salt. So say you've just, someone has just murdered your whole family. No, someone uh, has just attempted to murder you when they tried to attempt to murder their entire family. But you got away and you're now in a safe place and someone is like, has like wrapped a blanket over you, you'd say, hmm, I feel like an egg yolk. Oh, so like I'm sort of cozy and, and in a safe place. Thank you. It blows half a pelican. Contact, give me a sentence. What blows half is. Wow. Someone has murdered your whole family. <laughs> it blows half a pelican. It's very windy? Yeah. Fair. Why half? It's, mm, Why is it died? Why is it half a pelican? I'm not really sure. It's blown away. Uh, the other half. That's why. I didn't know so much. Straight down the middle. To swallow a camel. Is it like having a lump in your throat? No, because then it would be attempting to swallow the camel. You've swallowed the camel. Oh, it's already swallowed, so it's not. It's fully swallowed. Camel. You you bought it. You you you've you believed a lie. It's like someone has murdered your entire family. <sighs> you know, but you still want to be their friend. So you kinda of have to like swallow the whole camel and just suck it up. Yeah. To go cucumber. Uh, to go missing. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why do you think cucumber? Because that's what happens when you go somewhere, usually in English. Are you boring? Because cucumbers are maybe boring? No, cucumbers are not boring. They're delicious. They are, but what does it mean? To go cucumber. It's like but saying it more isn't making it It's like, it, like, okay. So you have no intention of murdering your entire family. But one night you go cucumber. Go, oh, you go wild. Yeah. Classic cucumber. Yeah. Murdering yeah. the whole family. Cucumbers are wild in Denmark. Speaking of Denmark, listen to our most recent episodes of Bad People on BBC Sounds, a Danish case which actually directly affected Sophie. Directly. And there's, there's no families. BBC Sounds. Music, radio, podcasts.